This is a video update on the situation with Teal Swan and fake lawyers, who might well be real lawyers, but they're acting in a way which is not legally binding, does not require a response. They may wish a response, some kind of interaction, but it's completely unnecessary considering the issue actually involved. Um, this is the letter sent to me again, this time by a different organisation on behalf of the client, or the so-called client. She is basically one who did not like my uh, blog. That is an old 2015 uh, blog. Teal Swan is a fraud, that was the URL. It was changed to, uh, soon after, so the URL is in fact out of date. The Teal Swan is not a fraud. Linking a video which has since been taken down by a person who was probably threatened by Teal Swan. That's speculation, but in any case, they want me to take down the blog, which does not contain the video, it contains a link to a video, it does not make a case of any real kind other than the title, which is suggestive. The suggestive title, plus the tags, basically means when you're searching for Teal Swan, and if she's a fraud or not, you get linked to that blog. But in any case, this is going back to 2015, and now in 2019 it's an issue. Do you know what I figured? That video is no longer up. My blog is kind of null and void. So... I basically took down the blog, on the advice of my friend who's starting some further education in law. What the hell, full disclosure, the company that contacted me is in fact called Lambert Worldwide, and they basically are a business attorney and international advisors. How the hell does Teal Swan get in contact with these people? Presumably these people operate as a serious company. And they're taking personal disputes because Teal Swan happened to get some negative press. Regardless, the blog was pretty much useless at this point. Decided to take it down. Contacted Lambert Worldwide LLC and told them that the content is now removed. So yeah, I'm happy to negotiate on certain key issues when people are relatively uh, diplomatic. Although I do find it odd that Teal didn't contact me directly uh, via social media. Probably saved themselves some money. I don't know if money was involved with this, but I dare say it was. So, uh, yeah, consider that the rest of my content is up. It's not going anywhere. I don't really think this achieved anything of any real note, but it gave me an excuse to make a video, I suppose. Probably more entertaining than some of my more regular content. But apart from that, um, that's all you're getting.